Welcome to part one of an eight-part series of my trip to Jerusalem, Israel. In your lifetime, if you can make it to Israel, I highly suggest it. In this video, I left Israel and took a day trip to Bethlehem. Before we get started, please remember to like and subscribe. Bethlehem is a Palestinian city located in the West Bank in Palestine, about 10 kilometers to the south of Jerusalem, with a population of about 30,000 inhabitants. Bethlehem is the center of culture and tourism in Palestine since it is identified in the scripture as the birthplace of Jesus. This is Shepherd's Field. Shepherd's Field is a church that was built over a cave. The cave site is identified as the scene where the angel visited the shepherds and I'm sorry, the shepherds in Luke 2 and informed them of Jesus' birth. Now remember they were keeping watch at night over the flocks and the angel stood before them and they became very fear fearful. And the angel told them to not be afraid and was declaring news of the great joy that there was born in David's city, a savior, Jesus Christ. And then here we are just on the outside of the cave looking around observing everything before I actually go on the inside of the cave which now I'm starting to go in of course I had to get everything on the outside <laughs> Then I go on the inside and you can just observe everything here. And this is the area where the angel appeared to the shepherds. A depiction of where Jesus was born, where we will be going later. The first Christian empire came to exist in the fourth century by constantly the first Christian emperor 1700 years ago in the fourth century. So all of the location we have ruins, they found three chapels and a monastery. But everything is destroyed due to the Persian invasion in the seventh century and then the Muslim invasion in the seventh century as well. So we only have two things available to see. White mosaic floor and olive press, that's an olive press from the 5th century. Since this land has many olive trees, so from that time... And here, I am on the outside of the Church of Nativity, and look at that crowd. So this is the line, people are going in through the door, and I went another direction because the guide that I had, he didn't want to wait. He didn't want us to wait, which I would have been perfectly fine with waiting because I'm taking everything in and just really not really believing it, what's going on. And so we go a different route and, of course, skip, um, he skips the line, basically. <laughs> Caesar Augustus, the emperor of the Roman Empire, has decreed that everyone must be registered. So Joseph and Mary must travel to the city of his birth, the city of Bethlehem, south of Jerusalem. Many people are in Bethlehem to register. The only place that Joseph and Mary could find to stay is a stable where donkeys and other animals are kept. This is where Jesus was born. Mary wrapped him in strips of cloth and laid him in a manger, the place where food for the animals were put, which is now the Church of Nativity, which was built on top of where Jesus was born. And the Church of Nativity is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Mm -hmm. 